So we study multi-robot systems. Our main robots that we use are small little crazy flies that kind of fit in the palm of your hand. Here at Brown, we've flown experiments with 32 of them, but we also do things with fewer robots as well. So we are running experiments with Downwash, where we just care about the relationship between two different crazy flies. We'd like to know how close drones can fly together such that they can lift an object precisely, accurately, and have it delivered to a location. Uh, or this could be tied to search and rescue, uh, where we could help other people. We had one of the first Valkyrie systems installed, and the installation process was incredibly smooth considering how new these cameras were. They just worked out of the box, which is very impressive. We use Tracker 3.10. We do both rigid body tracking with objects built into Tracker, as well as some custom interfaces for single marker tracking. With the marker, now we are able to capture real-time data, uh, which factors in pixelated location. We send all of the data we get from Tracker over to a computer that runs ROS, the robot operating system. And we send this information to the drones to use as their state estimation to measure how far off the ground truth their sensors are reading. The high resolution is kind of unmatched with what's commonly possible from any sort of cameras that we have. It kind of makes our job easier in the sense that problems related to localization are solved so that I can focus on other aspects of research that, uh, that are more important to me. That's by far like, the coolest thing that we've done recently is getting these art students who had no technical experience, definitely no robotics experience, coming up with art projects that can use these robots. It really was a joy to work in these cross-discipline groups. Real-time data capture makes data analysis much easier. Normally, data processing takes a whole lot of time, which is something we can cut down based on the Wicon system that we have. I've recommended Vicon to people starting labs multiple times at this point. The precision that Vicon gives you if you want to do multi-robot research is definitely worth it.